Tie book screen printed pattern. Beautiful, right? One of the benefits is this of this is that if you cut it, you're not gonna really see any major uh, any minor imperfections. Now I've come to the point where you have to make a decision. Ideally, you don't cut your corners. Ideally. But uh, I would say half of the time it's inevitable. Half half the time. I mean, not cutting them saves time on the job. It also allows for the continuity of the pattern for those who stare at their wallpaper like this. Okay? So, in this case, it's inevitable. You have to cut it. Because I'm going to erect a simulated wall about 12 inches, and I'm going to make it an obtuse angle because a lot of the times we're dealing with irregular angles. I'll give you a moment so that you can look up the word obtuse. Just kidding. Irregular angles that are less than or greater than 90. Um, one is acute, the other is obtuse. I only say it because that's the technical name for it. Whenever you have a non 90 degree angle in a corner and it's not consistent you come up with this. Let me just show you. Por favor, venga cerca de zoom. Okay, what is this from? Okay, let me try to simulate it with two spatulas. Okay, so we have a situation whereby very simple but for those of you the homeowner right who's like what's going on here this is a 90 degree angle this wall with this that is a 90 this is not 90 but even if it were a little off I could I would still be able to install it without cutting it here's what's happening though we all agree Let's just uh, assume that this is a 90, right? Here's what's happening. Watch this. One of the walls is doing this. Not only is it not 90, but the wall from top to bottom is not straight. You see, if the, if the corner is 92, or 88, I can get my wallpaper in there. But when it's doing this, I'm exaggerating. You get this. Take a look. So this buckle dictates, now let's say you have a wall covering that's stretchable. I don't suggest that you try to get this out. This is literally more than a half of an inch of displaced wallpaper. If you're going to do it, do it at the bottom, behind the washing machine. That's what's going to be here. But here's what I want you to do. You need to cut the corner with this in mind. This wall needs to be underneath this wall. And the entrance to the room will dictate which paper goes under which. I'm going to cut this side of it. We don't want to cut off this bottom yet. We may need a quarter of an inch of it. Don't cut your bottoms yet. Now watch this. Because I separated this from this, I get rid of the buckle. Watch. 
Ah, gone. But what's the consequence? My pattern's a little off. You're not gonna see it. And if you're the type of person who notices this, there's something called Prozac, and it helps deal with that kind of condition. Okay. So, here's what I wanna do. You're gonna take this off. I was only kidding. Just kidding. I'm also an entertainer, just in case you didn't know. I don't think a lot of you watch all my video through and through because I say things during the video. And uh, if people were really listening through the whole thing, they'd identify the funny, the silly things that I say. Okay. Anyway, this is what I want you to do. You're overlapping. Now you can understand why. My cameraman is where you are, and you're looking at this wall. The adjacent wall has an edge. It needs to go under this wall because when you look head on at the wall, if you see the edge of the overlap, the overlap should be the underlap. That's the rule. So I have this under here. So look, we're gonna move it over. That's all. That's it. what I've been getting. Some guys are leaving me comments on my videos. It took this guy a half an hour to install one sheet of paper. What's going on? You see, if you're independently wealthy, you don't have to rush. You don't have to rush. Come on. Now listen, I'm starting my Wallpaper Academy in 2000, um, 2020. I need to know which of you good folks who watch me regularly want me to come to a city near you. I will be bringing two guest speakers and it will be a class. I'm going to have a junior class and I'm going to have an advanced class. The junior class will last two weeks and the advanced class will last three to four. I am um, halfway through the curriculum for the Academy. And of course it's going to be called Spencer Colgan Wallpaper Academy. And uh, just let me know if you'd like me to bring the, the uh, setup to your town. I like going around the country and um, it really, it's a beautiful thing. Okay, so now you guys who hang, you're like, okay, is that straight? You're right, let me see. Let me see. Now, the thing is, if it's not straight, I get to stop the video and redo it. No, I'm only kidding. Okay. We have 98% compliance. That's good. The, uh, the difference to overlap this and make it ugly is negligible. This is acceptable because the the corner is now perfect. We are going to move forward with this. My bubble is on the line. Good, 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 good. Don't, don't try to be God when you install wallpaper. You will fail all the time. Okay, cool. Um, I was recently diagnosed with narcissism. And uh, just for those of you who were concerned about me, I'm doing well. And uh, the prescription was to get rid of all of the mirrors in my house. So, uh, so far, so, so good. But I am cheating a little. I take multiple videos during the day. I mean, I can't help it. Okay, now we can cut this piece. And there you have it, folks. And that is how you cut your corner when you have uh, an irregular angle. Irregular, you know what I mean. E either it's uh, greater or lesser than 90. 
or it's the wall is not straight in terms of it being it's a little tilted okay there you have it if you have any questions leave it in the, the uh, comments section please click the like hit the subscribe button down here and enjoy the show see you on the next one